All right. Hey guys. Um. Now I'm gonna show you how to make something which I worked out how to do today. It's pretty easy, but there's a lot of steps you got got to take, and you got to be careful when you do it. Now, if you've played online and you've seen people which have those badges on the side of their helicopters or shoulders and you're wondering how you get it, I'm going to show you how to. Now, there's a few things you'll need, which I'll provide in the link um, in the description below. The first will be... Um, text view, which uh, I'll show you what, what it does. Basically, it turns JPEGs into the ARMA2 required file type, which is PAA. And um, the other file will, will be the squad fol folder template, which is what you need, essentially. Okay, so let's get started. First thing we're going to do is make sure it works. So just double click on it. Let it open up in a new page. Just wait. Okay, so website none, email none, picture none, members email. All this stuff is blank at the moment. What we're going to do, we're going to make make it so that there's info there. So now what we're going to do is open with Notepad. Now be very careful here. I'm gonna zoom in because it's quite hard to see. Oh, I can't zoom in, can I? Well, make sure you do it in between the arrows, unless I've all told otherwise. Okay, so let's get started with the first thing. The name of the squad. For me, I'm just gonna call it. Um, what should I call it? Okay, I know what to call. How the hell do I? How the? Name. So that's basically the um. Hang on a sec. I'm gonna get other one to refer to it. Uh, where is it? Squad. This is one I made earlier, but I can't really use it because otherwise it'd be useless. So the next thing is is the name of the squad, which is how. You, I'm not sure if you need to underscore or not, but I underscore, so just do that. How the how. I. There we go. So that's the name, the email of the group. Um, for this, I'll just make it my email. Uh, the website, we'll leave that blank for now. The picture, leave blank. Title. I believe the title is yes. The title is the tag again, so it's okay. Next thing is is the nickname, which um from it's got to be your exact nickname. So mine is Lone underscore Warrior. So it's your exact nickname in game. The player ID. Uh, to find that you go into your. Armour 2 game player profile. And when you edit it. It's got a player I ID. Down. Uh, in the bottom left. And you basically write that. that, that and then, uh, I'm just going to put that, that in for now. Because I don't want you guys really seeing that. Um, next thing is your name, so my name's Alex, email, note that you don't have to fill all, all these out, oh actually you do, you have to fill most of them out, just these things don't really matter, remark,
and this you leave blank unless you're gonna do it for multiple clan members okay so we'll just exit that save it okay now the next step let's get a picture um, for the purpose of this we'll just use the one I made I, I just go this is all that I use in game just for fun purple pegasus friendship is magic so what we do now is we um o open up text view and then what we do is we drag the image in and then we hit file save as and we save it as a PAA so it's already like that by default purple pegasus servo save and once it's saved you'll have this now you note that you can't view it it's just simply there for um later on now here's the um now we have to go back into the xml go into notepad and then what we do is where it says picture we put purple underscore pegasus dot p a a or simply you could just do this and then you go watcher you, you could just copy and paste or type it in whichever way you feel comfortable then we exit we save it one more time now this is the bit which gets interesting uh... we have to go to a website called webs it's free um... basically for this to work you gotta make your own website so, um, let me set Control A, webs. Make a free website. Okay, this bit generally is essential. You may, you have to make an account. It's free. Um, so we make a site address, which for this is just going to be however. Site. Hang on. Uh, C title just uh, put squad XML it doesn't matter and then select other template we'll just go with the basic one next step uh, untick everything because all it is is just simply all you need is home because quite simply you're not going to go to this site very often just do basic you don't need to be a member or anything um... now it says loading site builder basically it's nice and basic um... okay and now we go to manage pages we add a new page have a page just create a page call it whatever you are uh, call it whatever you want but but I just prefer if you just called it squad XML that'd be easier then once it's creating the page the next step is see so you got two pages now next step is simply to go to file manager now most of this is easy it's just until you get to the content part which is still quite easy but took me a while to find it okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna upload or we're gonna go to single file uploader choose a file
Um, so I gotta find my halber. And then you upload these, all of them. So, gotta do it one at a time. First, upload the image, which is the PAA. Upload. And then just basically upload all the squad ones. So. So by the end you should have five files uploaded. Uh wait four of them should be called squad, the only one it shouldn't be is your PAA. So this is what you have, squad XL XSL XML D T D C S S Purple Pegasus dot P A A. Um in a nutshell, the o only one you edit out of all the squads is the XML. The rest just the functions to get it to run. Okay, once you've done that, we go back to e edit website. Now, with our new page at squad XML. We do this, we hit content box one, two, we we do this four five and then what you do is you clear out the writing you you don't have to make a title. Um you can if you want but you don't have to. We go to link go to my files and then you just simply load in all of these so you go one and then in the next one well we tick that next one you go to link again my files so basically by the end squad from squad to purple pet pegasus all of those files will be in each one of those boxes um, hang on a sec now we're just gonna skip through a bit and go to one I made the one I made earlier home purple pegasus so this is the one I use basically by the end you'll have all these files in and then we when we click on this file the squad XML will have this. So that page you saw earlier, which was blank and empty, now has your information. And then once that's done, the last thing you do is copy the link and go in game. Oh, and um, one last thing is once you've made everything. Where it says web, you just copy and paste the website home if you want to. Yeah, you just post it there. So it'd be like probably webs, I don't know, whatever. But that's where you post a website thing if you're running a clan. Okay, once you're in game, you um, paste the squad U URL where it says squad U URL. Basically, you copy and paste the link and then paste it there. And then, once you've done that, you click OK. You go to multiplayer, and to make sure it's working, we'll just make a server. 
I'll go to play, just disable so it loads faster. And boom, see, I've got the tag PP, my email, no I am, remark, friendship is magic, purple Pegasus, and then in-game this image here will appear on the side of most vehicles, not all, but most, and it will may appear on the side of some soldiers, depending. So there you go. If you've got any questions, ask me in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.